just brought some cows down here for the winter. We're going to um, spread some straw around now. these cows wow. from a little bit further away we're going to take back in the box and put them all in that big pen where all the other ones have been going to out the window here and then white dots in the field there are some serious mushrooms we've had quite a lot of mushrooms this year for some reason but there's loads there just thought I'd show you Second lot done, we're gonna go get some more cows from further away and then they get fed twice a night. I mean, twice, one in the morning, one in the night. We are now going to be feeding some cows that aren't the farm they're in, a separate shed. We're going to drive over there now. Got a bag of milk, turn that down. Got a bag of milk here, we're gonna take. So let's head over. It's raining night time. It's only half past five and it's really completely dark. But let's get on. We are now here. I've pointed the tracks of lights at the shed so you can get some sort of light in there because I don't know if there are any lights in there or not. Who knows? But um, it's raining. lens already let me just open this one right you're not going to be able to see much because it's dark but I'll try and film best I can. I'll have to line the mill along this way, I think. I'll go. I might go on the inside. 
Let's see. I don't know how well it picks it up, but that rain is ridiculous. But that's empty. Can't see on camera very well, but all the cows look fine. So, let's seriously get out of here. That is a joke right there. Obviously I'll shut this door, I just want to put all my stuff back in the tractor. So let me shut this door a second. That's now shut, and in there it's actually quite warm, so they'll be nice and there's a lot of hay and straw in there, so they're all bedded up and done nicely. So let's get back home, and I've got some other calves to feed. I was going to show you the shed, but it's obviously too dark now, so I'll show you tomorrow morning. Now that I didn't these supports for the pillars for when these slats will go across, they've moved all them close to the shed now. And here they're putting a slat on. I'll go over and show you. So now the floor is starting. Close one. That was a close one. Ooh. While the telehandler is inside the shed bringing them in, we've got this wheel loader here and it's bringing them closer to the shed because the field has got them so wet that the telehandler cannot move them across. But that is all and I hope you have enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.